I'm gonna show you how to make any TV a smart TV, okay? So first of all, this RCA TV here, this is a non-smart TV. There's no internet or apps. However, we can make it a smart TV by adding a different uh, device, and there's tons of different devices, but let me give you some examples, okay? All right, so you wanna make your regular TV into a smart TV so you have access to internet and apps. So there, I have several options here, but there's much, much more. Uh, let's start off with the first one here, is a the most popular Google Chromecast, okay? You can see how this looks. You got an HDMI port here. You plug that in the back of your TV, and then through this, you can get internet, apps, Netflix, Prime Video, all that good stuff, okay? Another alternative is getting some kind of Android box to hook up to your TV. Another one is the Apple TV here. Also, you have the Amazon um, Fire Stick here as well. You can also use a Roku streaming stick. And I'm gonna put links to all these on the bottom description below, okay? Another option, you have a Roku Premiere, Premiere Plus here. The cool thing with these two here, these two here is you have a power button that you can turn your TV off and on. Instead of using your, like, your original remote, you can just use one remote. Also, the thing is, uh, with a, a lot of these TVs, even smart TVs, the internal speakers are really not that great. So what you can do instead of buying a separate um, sound bar, what you can do is you can buy a Roku stream bar here. It's basically a mini sound bar. You hook this up, you can get internet, apps, through it all as well. They also have an actual huge sound bar that you can use as well. And you, you'll get internet, you'll get apps and all that as well. Now, in my opinion, like which one's the best bang for the buck? I have several of them, okay? I would say one of the best bangs for the buck is a Google Chromecast, and it doesn't matter if you get the first generation, second, or third generation. Also, the Amazon Fire TV stick is a good bang for the buck. Something like this right here, the Roku Streaming Stick Plus, okay? Good bang for the buck as well. Let me just go ahead and connect one of these. I think I'm just gonna connect the uh, Google Chromecast to this non-smart TV to make it smart, and we're gonna have internet. So let's go ahead and plug this in really quickly. All right, so I'm gonna plug the Google Chromecast into one of the HDMI ports on the back of this TV here. I'm gonna go ahead and pop that right in there. Then I have a power adapter. Let me just go ahead and plug this one to the wall. Okay, so my Google Chromecast is plugged into the HDMI port in the back of the TV. Now let me go to the correct HDMI port. Let me click on source on my, re on my remote here. Yours may say source or like input. So let's go ahead and change this. And I think this is on HDMI four should be the google chromecast let's see yep there it is and here's our remote to the google chromecast right here and voila guys i got internet on here i, I already set this up too but i have uh internet i have apps sling netflix youtube disney plus prime hulu hbo max is one of my favorites right now and of course you can download more um, apps as well okay so pretty easy so this is basically how you make a regular standard TV into a smart TV. Smart TV as in having internet and apps. So if you guys have any questions or anything, just uh, comment below, all right?